My battery's about to die. Do you have a charger? You can create radio waves, send power from one spot to the other through the air. And this is completely mobile. So as you walk around the room, this tracking is constantly happening and finding where your mobile device is so it knows exactly where to send the power. I kind of envision it a lot like a Wi-Fi, um, that wherever you happen to go, you have that conductivity. In this case, you have power conductivity. What Tesla did is he basically understood that if you call a Tesla coil, if you take this coil and you put current through this coil, it creates a magnetic field. And that magnetic field propagates through space. If you put a coil on the other side, it goes into the coil and then creates current on the other side. That concept as a whole is something that um, certainly was revolutionary. His tower would have loomed over the landscape for miles. It was 187 feet high. The purpose of the tower essentially was to be able to tap into the energy that Tesla believed was in the earth that he thought he would be able to transmit to people around the world as wireless electricity. I think looking at Tesla, he realized that he was really ahead of his time. But I think innovation is always coupled with the need and is technology ready for it. hundred years ago, there wasn't cell phones, you know, there weren't wearables. Technology has caught up and really enabled us to go back and say, look, these really can't apply today. And being able to take their vision and morph it in today's world is very exciting. It just opens up a host of opportunities that people haven't even thought of yet.